guys we have this question and we we are told that figure 1.1 shows a plant cell that has been put in a concentrated salt solution yes because this is well, this is a result when a plant cell is put in concentrated solution it loses um, the cell wall remains in its shape but the cell membrane loses water so it loses water now a identify the parts labeled a and b so this is question a so part labeled a is cell membrane okay it has shifted because it has lost what water so that one is a cell cell membrane b where is b b is pointing to those white circles those are chloroplasts chloroplast okay then b1 question b1 they're saying what happens for the cell to reach this state it was placed in a concentrated solution okay you can say the cell was placed in concentrated solution so in brackets you can write is hypertonic solution hypertonic solution okay hence it loses it it lost water okay it lost water by the process called the osmosis by osmo osmosis question b2 question b2 is saying state the term given to the cell in this condition plasmolysis okay plasmolysis all right plasmolysis next question is question what question is this question 3 b3 so they are saying how can this condition be reversed how this how can this condition be reversed so this condition can be reversed by putting the cell in dilute solution okay dilute solution this dilute solution is usually hypotonic solution hypotonic solution such as pure water all right next question next question which is question d a b c not d question c i'm saying give one reason why the structure labeled c remained in its natural state so you can say structure c is is made up of cellulose which is rigid or which is tough okay which is tough uh, d question d give two differences between a plant cell and an animal cell okay so you can say now the difference number one a, a plant cell a plant cell has a cell wall while 
an animal an animal cell wow an animal cell doesn't have okay doesn't have a cell a cell wall another difference is that the second difference is that a plant cell or you can say most plant cells have chloroplasts okay why would say most because some don't have chloroplasts like root hair cells they don't have chloroplasts in the roots and chloroplasts is only uh is only used for photosynthesis because it contains chlorophyll which is which traps light energy so photosynthesis takes place in the leaves and not in the roots so root hair cells they're plant cells but they don't have chloroplasts okay so you can say most plant cells have chloroplasts wow animal cells animal cells animal cells don't have okay don't she don't have all right thank you so much that's that's what with this question let's go to the next question